Hello everyone, this is Taria from Hidden Truth Tarot, and this is going to be for the sun, moon, and rising sign of Gemini. Gemini, this is going to be for the week of the 21st through the 27th of January 2019. I hope everyone had um, a very happy, blessed new year, and I've been meditating and shuffling the cards before I started, so they're ready. So we're going to go ahead and just get right on in with your reading here. And I will be clarifying with the steampunk as well. And pulling extra oracle cards for further clarification. Alright, Gemini. Let's see what we have going on for you. Alright. So, overall energy for this week, Gemini. Two of Wands. So, there's a decision you're, uh, you're needing to make this week. Um, this is the energy of trying to decide which path to go down to to you know i i feel like you have two opportunities here and i feel like it's very important for you to take time out to ground yourself this week i will be clarifying as well but you know it, this is a decision that is going to be life changing for you all right and <laughs> Beautiful. I'm sorry. I'm laughing because this is the situation of the week, Gemini, and we have the Ace of Wands. So you have a new opportunity, something that you're very passionate about, Gemini, and that's what this decision here, this uh, new path, this this could be uh, taking a chance on uh, switching jobs. This could resonate many different ways. We'll look at. <clears throat> Excuse me. I will clarify, but that's that's beautiful. This opportunity very nice all right what's driving you you have the world you have completion okay you are um th this is just beautiful so you're this is endings and starting a new beginning here um I, this is also uh spirit wants me to tell you to make sure that you assess you look back on this cycle that you're ending gemini and make sure you release any negative or anything that wasn't serving you that way you don't repeat any uh cycles um with this new beginning you have coming in oh very nice recent past so the two of pentacles this represents adaptability change major life changes here so you could have been um juggling two different jobs maybe and now this is your chance to move forward uh with something that's going to be more successful for you is what i'm getting what's crowning you this is beautiful and then we have three twos on the table by the way overall energy two of wands recent past two of pentacles now what's going on in your mind what's crowning you gemini is the two of cups this is like a soulmate connection this is a very heartfelt connection between two people this could be business partners uh this could be uh, a contract between two people this could be marriage we i will be clarifying so this is beautiful energy very nice very nice new circumstance gemini the chariot this is victory success getting control over your life Having control over your will and moving forward. You could be dealing with a cancer as well. I'm going to go ahead and clarify these cards for you. This is beautiful energy, Gemini. All right. What is this two of wands for Gemini as the overall energy? Two of wands. All right. So we have the Hierophant clarifying the two of wands. Uh, you could be dealing with the Taurus. Uh, you could be involved with the Taurus. You could be partnering with the Taurus. This is somebody that I feel like is older than you, that's helped you, that's mentoring you possibly. Um, this is somebody that you look up, look up to and respect, I feel like. So let's go ahead. Let's clarify the Ace of Wands for Gemini. Very nice. So you have the Ace of Wands clarified by the Ten of Wands. This is telling me that you have an opportunity to let go um, and be able to surrender um, your energy and do something, Go, you know, make with this uh, two of wands here. You're going to be able to choose a new direction, a new path. 
that's going to lighten your load with this Ten of Wands, okay? This, you've been loaded down. You have an opportunity now to be able to lift this load up off of you, Gemini. Very positive. What is this world about for Gemini? A world card. What is this world about? Oh, wow. Beautiful. All right. The world clarified. Nine of Cups. Come on. <laughs> You're getting your wish, Gemini. Uh, the Nine of Cups is a beautiful energy. This is the Wish Fulfillment card. Literally, all those cups lined up there are filled. They're overflowing with uh, just blessings, happiness, joy. Like I said, you're getting your wish on this uh, new beginning, okay? <clears throat> what is this Two of Pentacles? What is this Two of Pentacles for Gemini? The recent past. Five of Pentacles. Very nice. Two of Pentacles. Clarified by the Five of Pentacles. Okay, so like I said, I really do feel like this card can represent feeling uh, left out in the cold or having a feeling of lack of finances. I really feel like this goes back to this Hierophant here, this Taurus, um, this older person, this teacher, mentor, somebody that you look up to. This could be your significant other or deciding to uh, make this person, you know, get in a relationship with them. But you're going to ask, you know, for help here. And this is where this adaptability comes in, um, change comes in. Um, I really, because the Five of Pentacles represents you still have people that you can ask for help. There is people that's there to help you. And I feel like this is, like I said, this could be business. This could be just partnerships. Let's do this Two of Cups. What's this Two of Cups about for Gemini? Oh, my goodness. All right, so the Two of Cups represented by the Will of Fortune. All right, I call this the Will of Fates, okay? This is fated. This is um, a destined situation here um, that you are, you know, set upon. It's going to be, you're going to have success in it, though. This will is turning in your favor, Gemini. I feel like there's been a contract or a partnership that you are you are partaking in with this hair fate here. Uh, you know, this is I read all of my comments, you guys. Please, uh, please comment and let me know how this resonates with you. This is very uplifting and positive, and I'd like to know exactly what this is about. <clears throat> Beautiful. All right. Chariot. Victory, success, control, clarified by the Ace of Swords. This is the Sword of Truth, Gemini. This is, uh, you're going to have a new beginning. That You're going to have a lot of clarity. And this clarity is going to, you know, drive you to success and victory. This is a very nice reading for you guys. Very nice. Please comment and let me know. I'm going to pull an Angel Oracle as well to see what extra message they have for Gemini. Very interesting. So we have patience. Now is the time to learn, study, and gather information. Enjoy being a student because in the future you will synthesize your knowledge into action. So some of you could be students. Some of you could uh, be starting a um, on a, a, a new degree or um, maybe technology center, you know, the Hierophant with this teacher, somebody helping you, somebody helping you go, you know, thinking about starting a different path, something maybe you were studying and now you decided to end that, complete it, and move on to something else. But this also goes with this clarity right here. You know, your angels want you to know you have the clarity that you're going to need to have this new beginning, however this resonates with you, with this victory and success, okay, as your new circumstance. This is all faded and going in your favor, Gemini. I'm going to pull an affirmation for you, Gemini. Let's see what the affirmation is. It's saying we have it right here. Very nice. I find a deeper meaning and personal growth amid the discomfort. So, very nice. Very nice. Um, this is going to be different for everybody. Like I said, please uh, comment and let me know how this resonates with you. 
Gemini, thank you so much. I wouldn't be here without you guys viewing my videos. It means the world to me. I thank you from the bottom of my heart. And I send you all my love, wishes, and blessings. Bye-bye.